What's up, it's Cairo. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing Jess Guy Spells with some of the new cards from March of the Machine. It is release day. I did hit the pre-release or the uh, early access event and there are a bunch of decks that I played during that event, but this is a new one. So I wanted to not play those same decks and go into something else. So we have Jess Guy Spells here. It's kind of like Is It, but with one important white card. And that is Monastery Mentor. This three drop 2-2 two -two with Prowess. When you cast a non-creature spell, create a 1-1 one -one white monk creature token with prowess also that can just pump out some tokens we can also pump out some tokens with third path iconoclast now they don't have prowess and their artifact creature soldiers but we can use those tokens to convoke our spells like stoke the flames four mana four damage to any target a lot of times you'll take out a big creature with this or you'll just hit them in the face and trigger your prowess things whenever you attack we also have a home we're testing for Jaya Fiery Negotiator. This is a Dominaria United card that didn't find much of a home. Because is it wasn't super good during Dominaria United Standard, it didn't get enough uh, love. It was basically mono blue. But yeah, other than that, we do have uh, a bunch of like classics here from is it Monastery Swift Spear, Play With Fire, March of Swirling Mist. A couple of shore-ups down here to protect our things and trigger our prowess whenever we need to untap something and block. And two other new cards, Baral and Kari Zev. This is three mana, two, four, first strike menace, so it's a good blocker with four toughness. And whenever you cast your first instant or sorcery spell each turn, you may cast a spell with lesser mana value that shares a card type with it from your hand without paying its mana cost. If you don't, create Ragavan, a legendary 2-1 red monkey pirate creature token that gains haste until end of turn. Good for creating a blocker if you need it if you're racing. Good for also just getting in another 2-1 hasty creature and casting free spells. We also have Meeting of Minds. This is a common card that I found to be pretty good whenever you're making tokens. Just convoke it draw two cards so as long as you have one blue mana available doesn't matter if you have monastery mentor white um creatures but you can tap any amount of creatures that you have and add one mana one colorless or a mana of their color to this and you can do this at instant speed so this is a pretty cool common here overall this card is this deck is actually not very expensive to build we do have some mythics and stuff but there's a lot of uncommons in here so this is a good starting deck for the new set yeah, it looks like we have Monastery Mentors a Mythic. They're all on Kari Zeb's a rare, but Wandering Minds uncommon, Third Path Iconoclast is uncommon, uncommon. Kenra Spell Spear is a new card. Sorry, some new cards in here that I didn't go over. This is a two drop two two trample prowess. Three and a blue or Phyrexian blue. Transform it, activate only as a sorcery, and it becomes Gataxian Spell Stalker. 3-3 three, three, Trample, Ward 2, Prowess, Prowess. So the cool thing about this card is it has that Ward 2 on it. So if your opponent's at like 3 or 4 mana and you get this transformed early, it taxes their removal spells and it's kind of hard for them to get rid of as long as it's not late in the game. And this card has actually been pretty cool. So that double Prowess, meaning that you hit them with a Play With Fire or something, and all of a sudden this is a 5-5 five, five Trample. So in the land suite, we have Sokenzan, Crucible of Defiance, all the dual lands in Izzet, and Secluded Courtyard. Most of the things in here are human. There are a couple things that you can name just if you need a, a mana of any type to get those things cast. Um, not absolutely necessary. Might take a couple of those out. But if you draw planes and you need to cast one of your humans, being Third Path, Iconoclast, Baral, and Kairi Zev... Uh, swift spear anything like that you can name human here so hope you enjoyed the video thanks for hitting that thumbs up thanks for subscribing cannot wait to announce uh, I, I couldn't wait to announce that i'm actually going to be at magic con minneapolis may 5th through 7th and i don't know what time it's going to be but on saturday and sunday i will be at the content creator booth so come stop by play a game and uh say hello it's going to be awesome so i'm going to document that too so until next time, have fun in the arena. Opponent goes first. We have Kumano faces Kakazan, Baral, and Karizev on three. Okay.
Okay, that is a very timely two drop. Let's see if they have a counter spell. If they want to counter it. Nope. Fading hope though, maybe. Yeah. Okay, legendary team up. First strike menace when you cast your first instant or sorcery spell. You cast one from your hand with the lesser amount of cost if you don't create Ragavan. There's the djinn that we were waiting to see. Alright, let's not attack. Let's see if they have anything to say. Now, since they did that, we'll stoke the flames on this. Red. Red. Now they're tapped out, and the gin goes. Get them with the Convoke. See if they have a Talarian Terror or another gin. Stowaway. Alright, let's let them block whatever they want. We'll just transform this now. Alright, we have our Gitaxian Spell Stalker, Trample, 3-3 three, three, Trample, Ward 2, Prowess, Prowess. We've got a token, we've got a third path Iconoclast. They're going to get the loot by hitting us here. And we've got Meeting of Mines and March of Swirling Mist that can set us off here. Do that save one for the Convoke. Okay, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That'd be ten, eleven. So we're not quite there yet. So we'll just save the March of Swirling Mist. Okay. I think we got there. I don't think there's any way that Mono Blue is going to be able to take care of such a wide board. Two cards, three life. Werewolf will draw him a card. That's okay, I think. We're not going to march a Swirling Mist yet. If they play another Djinn or something, we'll march that. Alright, cool. Got there. Yeah, Gitaxian Spell Stalker. I like you, my friend. Opponent goes first. Mana looks good. Okay. We can keep it. Hey, there's Jaya. We don't have any creatures that could benefit off that counter other than Swift Spear, so that's what we will do. Jadar. Okay, so they're Abzan then. So they're probably running Thalia and Gitrog. Not bad. So what we have to do here...
is we have to go like this. I have to go like this. Tokens plus one plus one. Okay. And then I'm gonna attempt to shore up this swift spear and block their biggest thing. Malira. She's another target creature artifact. Let's put in the grave bear, return that card to the battlefield. <sighs> Alright. No attacks. <clears throat> we're going to Meeting of the Mines, we're going to make a 1-1, one, one, and we're going to trigger our prowess off Swiss Spear, and hopefully that'll be enough. They do have a Plaza of Heroes up here, and Malira. Come in with that. Alright. Okay, uh, the one one we can block with, or it does have prowess. So next turn, we can march of swirling mist all their stuff. What would that have looked like? I guess they didn't have anything in their hand. But if we took this damage, we go to six. Then we march of swirling mist out everything that can block, meaning this, this, and this. And then we go three, four, five, six damage, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight. Yeah, we would have got there. All right, good game. Opponent goes first, Island Mountain. That means Kumano, turn two, third path, Iconoclast, or Swift Spear, Kumano, sec yeah, okay. All right, I think we're good with this. Let's draw another land. No. Okay. We'll do it this way. Draw another red source. We can get this third path iconoclast out. Ugh. Yikes. Alright. Well, then we have to go here. That's probably going to get burned away. No. There's a plains. We'll attack with this. We'll keep up the March of Swirling Mist in case they do a targeted removal on something. We give up the damage, but at least it's protected, so that way we can maybe draw another red source to do a... Well, at least it was protected from that, too. Okay. So let's, let's name Jackal for this one. Alright. Two Brotherhoods ends. Not sure we can really get past that.
Brotherhood's End won't take care of that, but plenty of other things will. Menace First Strike. We get to create Raghavan. Ooh. We might get there after all. Because we don't have another spell to cast without playing its mana cost, so let's... Um... There. Raghavan with haste. Go three. We've got a shore up. Emperor, sure. Think we're gonna get there, fam. Shore this up. Keep this one. Good game. Yes! Baral and Karizev got there. And Ragavan. Thanks, buddy. Alright, we're going first. This is looking pretty good, I think. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We can do this. We'll have to do this as human. Turn one. Okay, one more mana, we can go Kumano. Farmhand, grab a planes. Alright, we've got to get this damage going. Should have waited to cast that, but whatever. Okay, better than a depopulate, I'll say that. Alright, so... Let's get this prowess action going. Save the March of Swirling Mist if they do a... Board wipe. We'll save our mentor and our swift spear, probably. Okay, nothing. Probably have an emperor, so we'll just attack. Yep. I hope you're ready to lose. Mm, I think that's okay. Stoke the flames, we can deal four to them, trigger this. Okay, I think we're alright. So we'll just keep up March of Swirling Mist. We're gonna have the etching of Kumano coming in next turn. Just wait. Alright. Lightning strike. In we go. See if they have another Emperor. They do. So they go to 11, 2, prowess 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This is go to 2. Now we need to do a lightning strike. Alright, we got there. We got there. 
Good game. Good game. We're going first. Courtyard can help us cast our mentor. Kumano, maybe turn one into Swift Spear into one of these. Okay. Is that the best way to go about it? Or is it Swift Spear turn one, Kumano, then one of those? Probably that, right? Probably this. And then if we draw a good two drop, we'll play that and we'll play Kumano after we already have Monastery Mentor out and stuff. Yeah, this seems right to me. They either have a Fading Hope or a Consider in their hand. I'm hoping it's a Consider. Oh, Spell Pierce. Okay, that too. At least we got the Prowess. Spell Spear. Interesting. So, we want to go Human. So we can cast this. Let's attack first. Bye, you two. Okay, there's a play with fire. So, we'll attack first, see if they have anything to say about that. And then we'll go Mentor. Next turn, we'll play with fire. We'll start going wide with tokens, or wider, anyway. Get the maximum bang out of this play for fire with our prowess creatures. When is the Talarian Terror or Haughty Jin showing up? That's my question. Is it now? Is not now. Door up. Yep, I'll take that. Any instant or sorcery. Alright, good game. Got there, baby. Diamond 3. So that's it for Just Guys Spells. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for hitting that thumbs up. Thank you very much for subscribing and hit that bell to get uh, notified whenever I upload new content. And just as a reminder, if you're going to be at MagicCon Minneapolis, May 5th through 7th, I will be there at the Content Creator Corner. Don't know exactly what time, but if you subscribe, I'll update on the community post. Uh, yeah, stop by and say hi. I'll be looking forward to it. So see you then. Have a good day.